Sid, we're home. Wake up. Oh, my God! Oh, we're home? Have you been making out with a stranger this entire drive back from Vegas to L.A.? No, we took a break to eat fries. This is Hansel. Well, I'm Hansel. Remember Hansel? He's the stripper from the Bachelorette party. I I'm a stripper. I know who you are, Hansel. Goodbye, Hansel. Leave the car, please, Hansel. Okay, bye. Wow, this is far. Sid, what do we say about bringing strange men into our communal spaces? Don't bring strange men into our communal spaces because of the guy who robbed us. The multiple guys who you have dated who have robbed us. Well, I wasn't going to bring him into the apartment. Hey, why is our apartment gone? What do you mean, why is our... Our apartment is gone. Is your apartment gone? Yes. In what some are calling the apocalypse, an alien race has begun vaporizing buildings, human life, and everything at random starting in Culver City, Los Angeles, and moving east. Oh my god, Ariana Grande just tweeted me at the news that we are in an alien apocalypse, RN, and a gif of a Pomeranian rolling its eyes. What does that mean? After months of peaceful communication with the alien race, the President of the United States accidentally tweeted at 3 in the morning. This message is apparently deeply offensive in the alien language. This is officially going on record as the worst thing the president has tweeted in the last 16 hours. Oh my god. Aliens are vaporizing everything in California and we are in California. Oh my god, what do we do? If you're in California, get out now. So the apartment is vaporized, the city is gone, we have to evacuate. What do we have packed from the bachelorette party? Anything that I bought when I was drunk. Crap. We have a whip, hand puppets. I think these are edible underwear. We'll save that. That's food rations. Or we could wear. We're not gonna wear it. We could wear it. Okay, so we're not wearing it. Can you call an airline to get us out of the country? Yeah. Do you have any preference of airline? Oh, I don't know. Any airline that will get us out of the country because it's the apocalypse. Well, I mean, do you have like sky points anywhere? I will push you out of the car and you will get vaporized. Oh, when things get vaporized, where do you think they go? If you don't find an airline, I will feed you to the aliens. Northeast Airlines, would you please hold? No. Stephanie, Stephanie, when is your next international flight? Actually, all of our planes have been vaporized due to the recent alien attack, so we don't really have any planes right now. But if you call back in a couple no, weeks, no, Stephanie, no, 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 girl, no. Can I place you on a brief hold? Stephanie! No! one have a very northeast day? No, unfortunately, Stephanie was just vaporized, so I'll be helping you out. My name is Chad. We have no planes. Can I put you on a brief hold? This is useless. Can I put you on a brief hold? Okay, well, the good news is at least we have each other. That is terrible news. We have to drive across the country, and you always make me drive, and I'm so tired I can't see straight. Well, Olivia, I can't legally drive because I got my license revoked after I hit that pedestrian. I don't know why you always refer to me as that pedestrian in the story. Because I feel bad, my dude. I feel worse. Oh, oh, let's play a game called Who Do We Know That's Totally Gonna Get Vaporized. Oh, who from the Bachelorette Party? Oh, 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 oh. um, Casey. Casey would so get vaporized. Oh my god, classic Casey not going through with her wedding due to alien vaporization. Lynette. Lynette. Oh my god, classic Lynette. Classic Lynette. Honestly, f Lynette. Yeah, actually, I like really hate Lynette, but I've always been really nice to her because like women empowering women and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, oh my god, there's a house. Oh my god, okay, let's ask if we can sleep there. If I can get an hour of sleep, I can drive. Oh my god, girls night! Girls hour. Girls hour! Hi, sir. I was just wondering if, in light of the vaporizations in the alien war, if we could just crash on your couch for like an hour. We can pay you in our bodies. Ew, no. And we're actually all booked up because of the vaporizations. See the sign? There is no sign. It says you. What What do you mean you're booked? This is a house. This is a house, not a hotel. My house is all booked up. It's full of people, OK? Listen, policy is policy. I don't make the rules. <laughs> you, ju you just made the, you made the them up right, right now. now. You just made them. No, I didn't make them up just now. I made them up 10 minutes ago, but you weren't here. So you wouldn't know that. I would sleep in a closet at this point. I would sleep on, like, like a cold, hard bathroom floor. I wouldn't do that to my bathroom floor. What the hell do you have on your heads? Listen, you want a real crown? I got one in a curio cabinet in there, lit up. Mr. Bakersfield, four years in a row, early 90s. Okay, can I put you on a brief hold? You're not on the phone, you're this in front of us. isn't a phone. Da -da 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 -da. Thank you for calling Brian's front door. Our hours are Monday through Saturday, 5 a.m. to 10 p.m. Brian wants to make sure you have the best possible stay. Is this guy serious? Yeah, you know what, I am serious and I'm not done. Be sure to have that mint on your pillow. <laughs> you just needed to add the mint thing. Hey, I have a cold, hard bathroom floor you can sleep on. I mean, how bad could it be? This will be a great place for you girls to stay forever. Wait, what?